Hi, James with the OneHourSmartHome.com. And today, we're coming to you live from CES 2020. And I'm here to answer one of the questions that we get a lot. What is Z-Wave? Well, Z-Wave is a wireless home automation communication protocol. This allows you to communicate with all your home automation devices, such as smart locks, smart security systems, smart cameras, and even smart light switches. One of the key advantages of Z-Wave over other communication protocols is that Z-Wave is very low power consumption, but still has a large range and can pass through walls and communicate with your smart home devices. What this means is that Z-Wave sensors in Z-Wave operated devices can run on battery power, where Wi-Fi devices typically consume so much power that they require a backup source of power or hardwired power. Now, Z-Wave does have hardwired devices, but the major advantage I see in Z-Wave for smart home communication and smart home protocols is that it has such lower power consumption that it can use battery powered sensors. One of the most popular Z-Wave devices on the market right now is the Ring Alarm System. I have one of these in my home and it works with Z-Wave. The sensors are reported to last two to three years before needing a battery change. I've had it for over a year. I've never had to change any of the batteries in my Ring security system, and I have the sensors all over my house. They're probably 100 feet away from the base station, and I have no problem with communication, and the communication is clear, fast, and efficient. Whenever a door is opened, I get a little report on my phone that the door has been opened or closed, or it will sound the alarm. So Z-Wave is a smart home communication protocol that uses less power than communicating frequencies, and it is a standardized network where different manufacturers from different devices will all interoperate together because of the standardization of Z-Wave. So this has been James with the One Hour Smart Home. Thanks for following us at CES 2020, and we'll see you next time.